Meanwhile, mayoral candidate Tony Busby is demanding accountability tonight after HPD's deadly drug raid investigation. This just one day after he called for the resignation of HPD chief Art Acevedo. Busby spoke only with Channel 2 investigator Mario Diaz, who's live in the newsroom tonight. Mario? Dominique, Tony Busby plays for keeps in the courtroom, and he is now doing so in politics as well. The candidate for Houston mayor pulling no punches in an interview this evening. Uh, the accountability has to start at the top. Mayor old candidate Tony yeah, Busby yeah, speaks to Channel 2 Investigates 24 hours after calling for the resignation of Houston Police Chief Art Acevedo over the events surrounding the botched drug raid last month that left two homeowners dead and four officers shot. There's a system in place that this chief allowed to be in place where a police officer, alleged so far, uh, could lie to get a no-knock warrant and to then bust into your house and if you resist it in any way, shoot and kill you. That should make everybody in this city a little bit worried. Worried after Channel 2 Investigates first revealed this blistering affidavit, a sworn statement by a sergeant in Acevedo's Special Investigations Unit, laying out lies by narcotics officers regarding the deadly raid. Busby, a former Marine, says the approach for true transparency in this investigation is simple. We're going to have somebody from the outside come in and look at this. Mayor old candidate Bill King has the same position. I first asked Chief Acevedo on Friday for his stance on an independent investigation. Would you be open to having the feds come in and investigate this case? You know, let me tell you something. I run this department. Acevedo now says he is open to it. He also admits he has been in contact with the feds from day one. There are a number of eyes that are on the investigation, not even concerned about that, not worried about that. However, the mayor did not endorse a federal investigation when Channel 2 asked him on Monday. I'm not afraid of the truth wherever the truth falls, okay? We're going to call a ball a ball and a strike a strike. Well, this was a, certainly a strikeout, and usually when you strike out, you have to go back to the dugout. Mayor Turner will get another plate, a chance at the plate tomorrow when he actually has a news conference scheduled at City Hall. The news conference is being titled Accountability and Transparency. It will take place in the afternoon. Joining him will be Chief Acevedo and District Attorney Kim Ogg. Channel 2 Investigates, of course, will also be there. Live in the newsroom, Mario Diaz, keep your seat. Channel 2 News.